Yo, what's going on guys? Havoc here and I'm back with another video. Today, we got some update news. God, it's been a while since I've done one of these. It almost feels weird to do it, you know? But we're back around for season 10 and we got a lot of juicy information, so let's jump right into it. Alright, so first up, bad news. Well, it's not really new news anymore, but the heal spell is completely gone now. I don't know, I saw a lot of people talking about it, so I'm assuming it's not new news, but... Yeah, if you didn't know, it's Kapoof. But you know, it's gonna replace with the Heal Spirit. Now yes, you guessed it, the Heal Spirit is kinda like the Ice Spirit and the Fire Spirits, except it heals. This will be the replacement for the Heal Spell. As Clash Real mentioned a while back, we're getting a card that'll replace the Heal Spell that is a lot better and more effective. So now instead of a spell, you'll be placing a troop that'll heal along with your push. Pretty neat, eh? Aside from that though, we have Season 10 and it's looking beautiful. The theme is called The Heist. More gold is gonna be able to be earned in this season, more than ever actually. The gold bank is getting increased to 25k for this season only. There's also gonna be a new game mode called Heist mode. If I do have gameplay, I'll show it right here, but I don't know much about that, so um, yeah. But you know what else is cool? Let's talk skins and emotes. We're getting a new treehouse tower skin, and this one's looking a lot better. It's, uh, well, I don't want to roast Supercell, but this one looks pretty dope. We also have the new Magic Archer emote. Obviously, if I have pictures, videos, and gameplay of these things that I'm talking about, I'll pop them on the screen. But if I don't, then yeah, I tried. Aside from that, we have new bandit emotes and the hunter emotes. Now, as far as the update for now, that is it. I mean, obviously there's gonna be a lot more stuff later on because a huge update was teased and I can't wait to find out what it was. But for now, this is this is fine. This is more than fine, actually. You know, it's just a little distraction. Now, these balance changes will go live on April 7th. That is one day after the season reset. So you guys can catch that on April 7th, about a week after April Fools. Well, tomorrow. Well, actually, that's... You know, what's today? April? Oh, today's April 1st. Okay, so about a week from now. So obviously, the heal spell is going to be reworked into the heal spirit. The total healing was increased by 181%. The magic archer is getting a small nerf of his targeting range from 7 to 6 tiles. The goblin hut's building lifetime is going to be decreased by 20%, but it now spawns three goblins when destroyed, which is kind of cool. So it's going to be kind of like the tombstone where it drops skeletons after it's destroyed. Yeah, you can think of it like that. And last but not least is the Skeleton Barrel. The speed is gonna be changed from medium to fast, and hit points are getting a reduction of 15%. So, um, yeah, pretty interesting balance changes. That's pretty much all the changes I have. I wish I had more, I wish I could tell you, but I don't. And I'm being honest, so don't spam me in the comments about what's the next update, because I honestly don't know. So far, so good, though. Season 10 is looking pretty juicy. I'm actually pretty excited about the gold. I've been asking Supercell for a bigger gold bank for, like, I don't know, since season negative 5. And they finally listened, and thank you. It's, it's, I just need gold, man. Anyways, that should be it for today's video. Hope you guys enjoy. The update is going to go live tomorrow. So, um, yeah, make sure, actually, we're all home anyways, so just... I guess wait for the update and play. With that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching. Have a gaming out. Peace.